guys, I'm Danielle and welcome to The Hit List. This is going to be such a great show because we have got part one of my brand new interview with Clay Aiken to show you. You guys are going to love this. I tell you, he's even sweeter than ever. After the break, we've got a video from Phoebe Dobson along with the interview you've all been waiting for. It's Clay Aiken and it's coming up next. Okay, guys, after the break, we've got a brand new number one video of the week. But first, as promised, here's part one of my new interview with Clay Aiken. Take a look. Interview of the week. Hey guys, it's Danielle and I'm here with Clay Aiken and we're in Detroit because Clay and Kelly Clarkson are on a stop on their current U.S. tour, right? right. We are. So this is your first major tour. It is. And how is it going? We're really, really excited about it. We've had yeah. a lot of good crowds, a lot of good audiences, um, uh, just a lot of energy and it's not getting old for us yet. You know, it's still fresh every night. Now you kicked off the tour in your home state, right? Right. We how did. was that? That was really neat. It was a little bit weird because since it was my, since it was my home state, mm -hmm. I was kind of down the street from places that I had been and I didn't really feel like I was I was on tour, so the first night was not as stressful. It didn't feel like I was out on this big national tour. It just felt I was singing in my hometown, so uh, that made it nice. A lot of fans from Raleigh there then? Yeah, they were, and then yeah. we actually swung down through Georgia, up down through Florida, and back up to Raleigh, so we made it back to my home, my real hometown the next week. Wow. Now, why did you decide to team up with Kelly for this tour? Um, actually, i got to give her the credit. She had the idea. Um, she oh. was uh, she, she knew that we were both touring t separately, and she just kind of thought, well, let's tour together, so she called me up, and she said, what do you think about it? And, uh, and fine by me, you know, we were, yeah. we were able to do it in, in, in larger venues than, than what, what we had planned on initially. Now, what's the show like then? Do you and Kelly do two separate shows? Do you perform together at all throughout the show? We perform, we do two, two separate shows, and yeah. it depends on what city we're in as to who closes, you know. Um, we alternate who closes every night, right. and, uh, and then at the very end of the show, um, the other person comes back out and sings a duet oh, with, with whoever's nice. closed. Mm -hmm. Now, what's it like being on the road together? Um, you know, it's really cool. We've never been, I've never really had anybody who I, since I've been doing this, mm -hmm. who I could be friends with who had been through everything that I've been through. Yeah. And so she's got a lot of the same experiences that I have um, been through. And so we've, we've really become quick friends. We didn't know each other before the tour. Um, and wow. now we've become fast friends. So. Now, do you guys share a tour bus or do you have separate buses for each other? We decided, you know, it saves money to, to share yeah. a bus and we get to, get to goof off on the bus. So we decided to share bus so we're that's awesome putting it around the country together <laughs> now what is life on a tour bus together like um you know what Kelly told me when we started out this whole experience she said I'm gonna be first thing I know I'm gonna be in the bus as soon as I as soon as we get onto the um, I'm gonna go to sleep and I thought that she would be boring but you know what she's decided that she wanted to stay up and we talk I mean we we're the last two to go to sleep sometimes so we talk and goof off and I pick on her like a little sister and <laughs> she picks on me like a big brother and so it's um so it's kind of funny Aww. now what do you take on the road with you to make it feel like home then I, you know, I really don't. I've, no? I've, I've kind of gotten used to over the past year not being at home and kind of making home wherever I am. So I really don't have to carry anything with me. My, my dog um, is, is actually on the road with me as of Winston-Salem, which is the next show. Yeah. Um, is going to stay with me for the rest of the tour. So uh, That's exciting. Now make sure you tune in next week to catch part two of my interview with Clay.